I covered all of the different armor sets in a previous video, but what about the armor pieces that don't really belong to a set? That is what we are covering today, so it'll be a short video. Thanks to user I can't think of a name for the video suggestion and for the compliment. Let's start off with tier one. In this category, we have the fin flops, aphid slippers, the gill tube, mite hat, and eye patch. What do they all do? Well, the eye patch has a defense of zero and is crafted with the ingredients on the screen. It increases your damage output while increasing your damage resistance. Buying the upgrade from Burgle will increase this item to tier 2 and give you an attack bonus on top of those others. However, it also does reduce your damage resistance. Next is the Aphid Slippers, which also has a defense of zero, and is crafted from the ingredients on the screen. Wearing these slippers will give you the quickness effect, which will increase your movement speed. Next is the Fin Flops, which also has a defense of zero and is crafted with all the ingredients I put on the screen here. Wearing these will slightly increase your swimming speed, and if you upgrade these from Burgle, they will greatly increase your swimming speed. The Gill Tube also has zero defense. You can craft this item with the ingredients on the screen, as with the trend. Wearing this will give you the Junior Diver effect, which will slightly increase your maximum oxygen while diving. The last thing in this category is the Might Hat. This actually has a defense of 1, is relatively cheap to craft, and gives you the Hyper Stamina effect. This effect will increase your stamina regeneration rate. Plus, you'll look like you're Canadian. Let's move on to Tier 2. But first, many of you who watch these videos are not subscribed, so if you could do so and help me out, that'd be great. Tier 2 consists of the Bubble Helmet and the Firefly Headlamp. The Bubble Helmet has a defense of zero, but it allows you to gain the Veteran Diver effect, which greatly increases your maximum oxygen while diving. This is crafted with the ingredients on the screen. The Firefly Headlamp has a defense of 3.5. This is crafted with the ingredients on the screen, and though it has no given effect, as the name implies, it just lights up the path in front of you for traveling in the dark. Finally, we have Tier 3. This consists of the Marksman Cap and the Mask of the Mother Demon. The Marksman Cap has a defense of 2.5, is crafted with the ingredients here, and increases the damage done by bows. The Mask of the Mother Demon has a defense of 3.5. It's crafted with these ingredients, and it gives all of your attacks a poison effect. The only other piece I didn't cover that doesn't really fall into a tiered category is the Gas Mask. This has a defense of 0.5, is crafted with these ingredients, and it guards you from the toxic fumes found in the haze biome. That is all of the armor pieces that don't belong to a set. Which one of them is best? Obviously they all have their own uses, but the best item does seem to be the Mask of the Mother Demon. This makes sense as it's the hardest one to obtain and you need to kill the Broodmother in order to craft it, but even though that, that one's best, personally I think I might go for the Marksman's Cap. It has decent defense and increases damage done by bows, and I prefer distanced attacking, so I feel that I'd probably find the most use out of this, probably paired with the crusty roly-poly armor. Do you agree with my selection of what the best armor piece is? Let me know in the comments. Also let me know what you want to know. What should I make my next video on? I hope to see you in the comments section, but in case I don't, thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in another video.